This winter here in northern Portugal has been extremely rainy this year and I've been noticing some mold appearing on the walls. I tried to use the air conditioning to dehumidify the air but the function to do it, it blows out cold air which is not very productive in the middle of winter blowing out cold air. So I started looking into big dehumidifiers but they're not only expensive, but the power consumption, it's almost the same as the air conditioner. So, in the middle of this search, I found out this portable dehumidifier by Auskin. Auskin is a, a Chinese brand, as far as I know, which is extremely small. It only takes up 40 watts of power. It has a, a transparent water tank for one liter it turns off automatically as soon as it reaches about 70 percent of the capacity of the tank it has leds with seven colors that change automatically or they can be turned off entirely or put into a fixed color it's ideal for rooms not big warehouses not big houses for a room for a bedroom a living room kitchen, a bathroom, something like that. Uh, just for reference, the water that you see now on the water tank, it has been taken or captured during a period of three days. <clears throat> and I'm using it in the hallway that uh, serves three stories of the house. So all of the air is being mixed between three stories of the house. With a power consumption of 40 watts, it takes about as much power as a normal portable laptop. This device is also very quiet. It produces, I think, about 39 decibels, which is not loud at all. Uh, I'm using this, like I said, on the hallway not inside any room specifically, so I, no one hears the, the device working. It uses a Peltier thermoelectric process that basically, by charging a resistance on one side, it eats up a lot, and on the other side, it cools down a lot. And on the side that cools down, or get, gets cooled down, that's where the water droplets start to condensate, and then they drop down into the water tank below. Here are several, several recommended scenarios, a wardrobe, the office, bedroom, living room, a hotel, a dormitory. There's the mention of the auto shutdown feature. Auskin Portable Dehumidifier And here's the device itself The power button and the lightning button so you can change the lightning mode here. Turned on automatically changing color. If you press the button again, it will uh, fix the color or set the color so it doesn't change. 
Okay, I press the button and it turns red. It won't change anymore. Power off. Power on. And the light will start to change automatically. On the back, we have this cover here. It has an inside metallic mesh to prevent dust from getting in. It can be washed, of course. Inside, we see the the before mentioned resistant resistance that is cooled down and is now catching water droplets because of the low temperature. You can see the water dropping down. This is basically distilled water that you can use for an ironing machine, for car batteries that need distilled water, but I wouldn't recommend drinking. Why? Because some bacteria might, might be living in the resistance above where the water is trapped and they might get into the, the tank, so don't drink it. Now just imagine that if this water was not trapped into this water tank it would be just flowing in the air inside your house building up mold and destroying your furniture and clothes. And now for the part that you've all been waiting for, how to take the water out. First, turn off the machine, pull the water tank out, make sure that there's no droplets getting out take out the lid I'm being extra careful but there's no need for you to be that careful In case you forget to empty the tank, the machine itself will turn off as soon as it reaches about 70% of the water ca tank capacity. So there's no worries about overfill. I hope the information about this product is helpful for anyone 
And if you want to buy one, you'll find down below in the video description my Amazon affiliate links that you can use to purchase one for yourself. Okay, bye bye now. Oh, before I forget, I just want to let you know that I've also recently opened a shop with partnership with teespring.com. For now, I just have the products that you see on the screen related to Portugal. So that's basically the Portuguese flag and three main tenants for the Portuguese democracy. Freedom, equality and fraternity. So in the near future, I hope to have some more themes, but for now, that's what I have available. This is a face mask, a pillow, a hoodie, front and back. This is like a flag to put on the wall. Several sizes, not too many colors. A bag. Well, I hope you find some of these products interesting and if you're willing to buy you have my many thanks. Bye bye now. And this is the final bye. Bye.